Philippine President Rodrigo Duterte has been in his hometown of Davao City for three weeks, the longest he's been home since he became president. Duterte has been in Davao City since August 3 and has been holding pandemic-related meetings with government officials from there, including his most recent meeting held on Monday evening, August 24. The meeting held on August 17 was done virtually, with only Duterte's longtime aide, Senator Bongo, physically beside him. The measures were taken as top coronavirus task force official Interior Secretary Eduardo Año again tested positive for COVID-19. Duterte was supposed to have flown back to Manila on the week of August 17. Presidential spokesperson Harry Roque says there's no definite date for Duterte's return to Metro Manila. He adds the president can discharge his function from anywhere. It's been a month since the country saw Duterte live in an official event. The last time was on July 27, during his fifth State of the Nation address. Meanwhile, researchers in Hong Kong identify what they say is the first confirmed case worldwide of COVID-19 reinfection. A 33-year-old man's positive PCR swab test came as a surprise because he had contracted and recovered from COVID-19 four and a half months earlier. Hong Kong microbiologist Kelvin Kaiwang To says the study proves that immunity to COVID-19 is, quote, not lifelong, and reinfection can occur quite quickly. To add, the virus mutates all the time. In the Philippines, the Department of Health reports 2,965 new cases on Tuesday, August 25, bringing total confirmed cases in the country to 197,164.